In this video, I'm going to show you how you can demonstrate a gravity assist maneuver. Dan Burns has a great physical model of how gravity warps space using four-way stretch fabric attached over a PVC frame. With this model, you can create a solar system showing the motion of planets about a star. Now in orbit again from a vantage point at a higher angle. You can also create the free return trajectory used by Apollo 13 to swing around the moon and return to Earth. To show the gravity assist, I'm going to use a marble shooter to launch the spacecraft, the orange marbles, one of the steel balls as a planet, and a ramp made from connects pieces so the planet can move across space. For the gravity assist that transfer momentum from one object, a planet, to another, our spacecraft, we need our planet moving. The steel ball is our planet will roll down the ramp, and the orange marble, if timed just right, will fly by the planet. Here's the same clip slowed down. And again, even slower. It's kind of hard to see if we're getting a change in velocity, so let's take a look at it overhead. It sort of looks like the marble is increasing in speed. I'm going to compare it to when the steel ball, our planet, isn't moving. Here's the same clip slowed down. Let's look at the two clips together. Slowed down, you can see the marble in the bottom half of the screen has a greater speed after it's flyby the planet than the marble above, and reaches the edge of the fabric before the marble that rounded the stationary planet. Here are two similar clips filmed from a lower angle. Again, the marble that rounds the moving planet gains speed and hits the edge of the fabric first. Besides showing an increase in our spacecraft speed with this model of gravity assist, you can also show using the maneuver to slow the spacecraft. The gravity assist maneuver allows us to send spacecraft into the far reaches of our solar system. The Cassini-Huygens spacecraft, depicted here, used four gravity assist maneuvers, shown as flybys in this graphic, to get to Saturn. Once there, gravity assists were used to maneuver around Saturn. Conserving fuel in this manner resulted in two mission extensions, allowing Cassini to explore Saturn for 13 years. I hope you make one of these models. Working with it has given me a visceral experience of what it's like to determine a trajectory to send spacecraft to other planets within our solar system. If you get a double flyby with your model, I'd love to see the video.